Very, excuse my book. This is in my worldly days. I used to work for the Floyd Event Company. Don't worry about it. Hi. And Genesis is say? also saying, is speaking to you and saying hi. Say hi, Momos. Say hi, Momos. Mama, say bye bye. Bye bye. Say hi, Momos. Bye bye. Oh. <laughs> What's up, family? I feel like I haven't seen y'all in like it's been a minute. It's been a, it's, it's, it's definitely it's, been a minute. It's been a while. Life has been life with me. It's been a lot. Like we um been going through it. Yeah, I mean just to keep it real. And it's hard too, right? Because like we, you know, we want to show like you know positive vibes and the glory of God and how good God is. But today we really realized that like um we gotta be transparent because also this is like you know it's not linear like you go through the ups and downs of life yeah. so we just been struggling with parenthood and we want to do like a reel of being a parent type of vlog just show yeah. you all the ups and downs and just really be transparent with y'all because it's not always sunshine and rainbows it's not always easy but in the end it is a beautiful journey nonetheless something we will never ever ever take for granted or regret it's just hard sometimes but i think anything that's worthwhile is hard it is i mean i think and you know we're also we, we still learn it and, and i think for us too we had to come to the conclusion that like we are not superheroes yeah like, seriously like we can't do everything. do it all on our own and i think that we were trying to do that and we both hit a breaking point where i mean i'm gonna be real i'm just keep it real mm -hmm. maya had a breakdown you know what i'm saying just because of just the stress and the, the pressure, pressure. Of, of just of, of everything you know genesis got uh not feeling well mm -hmm. so just that um i realized i haven't had a full night's sleep and i don't know how long um so i caught myself actually like literally had to pull over the other day and just take a nap in the parking lot of a kroger's because i was falling asleep on the road like that's how just exhausted, exhausted we are you know and um and like i feel like genesis definitely has regressed with her sleeping she was doing really good for a while but she got sick about a week ago and just that week of no sleep has really put a toll on us she was like waking up constantly after 3 a.m like every 15 to 20 minutes she would be waking up so it was just like there was no sleep for us so that definitely got to us i mean it makes it plays with your mind like it yeah. has you you know really just looking at things not in the right viewpoint you know yeah. and um and even just at each other, you know what I'm saying? And that like, like- It just puts tension. Attention, you know what I'm saying? Cause you're just so tired and you don't really see like an end. Like where's the silver lining? Like right. how, when does things get better for, for, for this and stuff? But in it though, you know- Resolution happens. And God's strength is, he's at his strongest when we are at our weakest. And that's what church was about today. It was just like, you know, once you come to the end of you, that's when God picks it up. It's like, okay, now it's my turn. You know what I'm saying? You tried it your way and now it's my turn. And what really helped us is we realized like we have to lean on our, and not be afraid to ask for help. Yeah. And so like, you know, Genesis staying with her grandma for a weekend, just yeah. <laughs> completely changed the ball game. Seriously, like, this is the first time Genesis ever like stayed a night away from us. Yeah. So she stayed with my mom and it was literally the best thing we could have ever done. Uh, it's like the best. It's like, why did we not think of it sooner? Exactly. Like, what have we been doing? So exactly. that's our thing now. Like every other weekend, she's just gonna go stay at her grandma so that we can have some time for each other mm -hmm. um, and time for ourselves too. Yeah. You know, also just realizing we also need time for like ourselves and stuff. And so, you know, like I, I want Maya to, uh, you know, be able to have that time. And so, you know, this and weekend, I actually went to this event you know, and then just getting out the house, Maya had a chance to just sleep. I literally just slept. And it's <laughs> like, sometimes all you need is just rest. Like we be thinking we need to be productive 24 seven. There's a season for that. And then there's yeah. a season for literally just doing absolutely nothing. And that's what I did this weekend. And I feel so much better. Yeah. And it just really helped with my mental health. It helped spiritually, like everything just by simply resting just and sleep. listening yeah. to my body and yeah. 
yeah so we're feeling so much better now we're actually preparing for javon's mom to come into town because she's also going to be helping us again that goes back to relying on our village yeah so she's coming in tomorrow and we're trying to just get the guest room settled for her you guys know we've been trying to get the guest room together and we have a couple finishing touches we want to make thanks to our sponsor of the day flex and spot for providing us with a adjustable bed and a mobile standing desk these are going to be the finishing touches on this room and i'm so excited yeah. to finally just you know close the chapter on trying to do stuff in this room yeah, i think it's gonna sure. be i love this room because it's very simple and it's very peaceful yeah but the bed definitely needs to be elevated so yeah. we've been looking for something to do that so when flexi spot reached out we were like absolutely we looked at their products they look really high quality yeah really high tech which javon loves yeah so we're gonna get into that and show you guys what they sent us yeah major shout out to flexi spot for sponsoring this video now we've been procrastinating on getting our guest bedroom together for months, so when they reached out about this, we were ecstatic. The FlexiSpot S3 is very easy to assemble and has a zero clearance feature which enables the bed frame to be used with or without the legs and placed directly on whatever existing bed base you already have. Now I have a FlexiSpot standing desk in my office studio that I absolutely love and the S3 shares the same core technology making it extremely adaptable to my needs whether I'm working or resting. Now one of the biggest pain points my wife and I didn't even realize we had was that it takes a bunch of pillows to prop ourselves up in order to watch TV or even read a book. The S3 showed us how much more convenient it is to have a bed that you can prop up with just a push of a button. It even has a reading mode that does all of the head and leg elevating for you, adjusting you to the exact position. It adjusts to your comfort level, eliminating any back problems you may have or just overall discomfort. The FlexiSpot comes with an SGS certificate and 10 year prorated warranty. If you buy your bed now using the link in the description, you can even save some coins, up to $300. We love our S3, and they even threw in an adjustable overbed bedside table because they're that awesome. Purchase your FlexiSpot S3 today. Are you ready for the walkies? Are you ready, 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 ready? Cause we're ready, 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 ready. Let's learn about the shapes. Yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, let's, let's learn about, about the, the. Let's learn about the. Let's learn about the shapes. <laughs> Jenna, you got, Genesis loves going on walks, y'all. Where's your walkie? The big loop around, Jenna. Did you like going by button? Yeah. <laughs> This is, the, this is the perfect neighborhood stroller, too. Right. <laughs> Her grandpa says she got a Bentley stroller. But it is a beautiful day out, y'all. Very beautiful. And we've just been feeling so much better. I know we were going to talk about parenthood a lot in this. And it just shows the ebbs and flows. Like, some days you'd just be on the brink. You'd be about to go off the deep end. And then the next What's day... the common denominator? Sleep. Right. No, literally. You got to figure out a time. If you need to go get a babysitter just for a day, bro. Yeah. Get your sleep. Sleep is so important. It's literally so important because I feel amazing now. And I feel refreshed. When we started this video, it was very suspicious. Like, so it's just about knowing what you need, utilizing the resources that you have available to you, and not feeling bad about it. Like, everybody needs sleep, everybody needs alone time, everybody needs self care. And just because you're a parent doesn't exclude you from that. You ain't gotta have all the answers, Sway. Right, that part. You know what I'm saying? Learning learn, as, learn you, as go. you go. And don't feel bad about it either. Don't let nobody tell you nothing either. Like, you know what I'm saying? You figuring it You're out. You're going to make just mistakes. Just like they had to figure it out. Yeah. We all figuring it out. You know, you know it is books technically on parenthood. But I mean, there's no, like, it's the only way you know it's fruit. Experience. Yeah, Whoever exactly. wrote it, it's their experience with parenthood and, and all of that stuff. So, 
You know, our daughter is healthy. She's happy. She's talking a lot more now. She literally said Gracie's like Corner, y'all. You think so. we're playing around, That's her but first words. she literally said Gracie's Corner. Shout like, out to Gracie no, and, really. and her corner, too. Because she corner, probably got the all. most popping corner for the for the kids out here. Yeah, for, uh, very much corner. And I, I, as a father, I'm actually just very inspired by just them as a family. Yeah. And what they were able to build. And how they were just able to set up Gracie. I don't even know if that's her real name, but I think it is. Is it really? It makes sense. Yeah. Yes. How, is yeah. it how they were able to just set her up to be such an influence and an impact on so many of her generation? And, and not others. only the generation, like parents, like she's impacted us because yeah, like purpose, man. And she's that's, helped that's, us. that's what happens when you step into your purpose. Um, and lean into what God has for you. You never know, you know what I'm saying? Who, I would love to see a documentary on even what made them start that channel in the first place. It's always gonna be bigger than bigger than you. It's gonna to help other people. Period. You know, so. We just got out of our appointment and uh, everything is good. I mean, our daughter is healthy as she should be. Yep. Um, and right now we're headed home to uh, go chill, probably give Genesis a nap before we can go to the beach. Yep. And then I need to pack and stuff. So, you know. Jenna, are you ready for the beach? <laughs> so this is what we got from Target, y'all. I got her this little sun hat with a little, look, she just grabbed it. <laughs> with a little bathing suit. This is so adorable. Obviously she's not going in the water, y'all, but so cute. it don't matter because she's about to go to the beach. So cute. So cute. You're gonna be so cute. Are you excited? <laughs> so here's the transformation, okay? Before, let me show you after. <laughs> Yay! Look at you, Jenna! I love this! I absolutely love it! So cute. Peach is your color! Peach is your color! Y'all, she looks so adorable. This is her first time ever wearing a little swimsuit. <laughs> so pretty, mommy! So pretty! <laughs> We haven't been to the beach in like over a year. It's been a minute. I think that, yeah, the last time you were still pregnant. Right. Gee. These kids is not playing. They are in the water. Yeah, it's packed. It's super packed. We gotta find. We ain't bring no towels. No yeah, we did. Umbrella. Uh, you didn't bring no. We need an husbands. umbrella. They just walk out the house. We need an umbrella <laughs> and little beach chairs. Like what are we supposed to sit on? We supposed to sit on the blanket. Okay. All right, y'all. Right, yeah, let me unpack my daughter. <laughs> Look, she went straight for her toys too. <laughs> Hi, can I put some sunscreen on you? <laughs> What a great day. Oh. It's such a great day to be at the beach. I didn't even want to come. At first, I'm be real, I was not on it. I'm like, man, I'm, I'm tired. And who want to sit out in the sun all day? But, but yeah, but you know, now that we out here, I'm in the sunlight, like I, I feel the vibes now. You know what I'm saying? I'm with it, so. We finna chill and have a great day. We gonna do a little montage, some music and all that stuff. Um, but we're gonna enjoy ourselves, so I hope y'all enjoy it too.
Chill. Next stop is Juicy Crab. Yeah, we've been craving it. Yeah, we've been craving Juicy Heavy. Crab. And Javon's leaving tomorrow. So with Javon leaving tomorrow, we want to do like a last hoorah. Right. You know, his mom is going to be here till Saturday. So we haven't gone out to dinner yet. So we decided to do a little Juicy Crab. Yeah. Say hi, mom. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Did you like the car? My mom got oh, the keys. Okay. Yep. So we will see y'all in Juicy Crab. Jenna, are you gonna eat some crab? She probably is gonna like crab. She yeah. mad bougie. She be like five eating crab. Today, draining. Yeah, sun is draining. Like, it really is. It's super draining. So I'm gonna go home after this. I'm excited because I'm about to take a shower. Take a nap. Pack. Yeah, wake up. I gotta pack. I gotta leave early. We probably leave at like 5 a.m. My flight leaves at 8 40. I'm gonna pick up a, the vlog on my end. This is gonna be a different episode, but out there so y'all can keep an eye on me. Yeah. Keep, keep an eye on me out in LA. Okay. Literally nothing better. So good. What'd you get? Lobster tail. Lobster tail. I'm gonna stick the sides. Some snow crab legs, corn potatoes, and mom got some shrimp. So we about to eat real, real good. And you gotta get lemons on the side. And make sure they add sauce to your thing. Make sure they sauce it up. And if they don't, ask them for some extra. Okay, y'all. So as you can see, we have made it back home, and uh. Um, got comfortable and stuff so we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog maya's in the bed right now y'all can hear uh she's in the bed right now i'm about to pack so i'm actually gonna start the next vlog so i can take y'all with me to la so love y'all and i'll see y'all in the next one my headphones a little bit yeah yeah, yeah. there we go Sometimes forgiveness come with bittersweet goodbyes Goodbye. Men I called my friends who would cheer on my demise yeah. Anger felt inside, I couldn't help but empathize Cause my blessing ain't they blessing and my God ain't they God yeah. The spirit kept me high even when I was at my lowest oh. Heart full of gold even when I was at my poorest oh. Though liquor would impede and the weed would supersede All the wisdom I would carry like a seed buried deep Ironically, oh. the flesh is made of dirt and so the root of sin is hurt uh. Foster by a world we would grow to know it's earth okay. The darkness overtook, the only light is in the book That's full of keys even past is overlooked.